Hello folks and welcome back to Warhammer 40k Chaos Gate Demon Hunters. Last time we did our first actual mission and we found some Polkswalkers, which now Inquisitor Vakir is currently researching. We got the research up and running. Well, the only thing we currently research at the moment is the uh, necropsy of the Polkswalkers. We started repairing up the ship. Uh, we're currently repairing the augmentation chamber, where we can start augmenting people into servitors. Um, we have our barracks here. I have named the other remaining two unnamed um, Grey Knights. We have Muxkai Rugen and Morthan Aelvar, a Justicar and a Purgator. Morthan's actually in, in Terminator armor already. Um, but we're gonna do, now we basically wait, I think. We're just waiting until something happens. Let time pass and see if we have somewhere going somewhere. In the meantime, the augmentation chamber gets repaired. Four. Blue. Bloom spawn detected. Our prognostic choir has detected the presence of three new eruptions of bloom activity across this sector. We have informed Titan and must act on these new incursions to the best of our ability. Commander, our prognosticers have detected this bloom in three separate systems. We should examine one of them. I have identified this planet as a mission location to combat the Bloom. Let us examine further. Okay, well fine, we'll examine From further. From here, you can see some details for this mission, including the resources that Titan's Armory will make available to us if we are successful. Okay, so we have ten servitors we get out of this. Echoes of Contagion. Corruption level is one. Poxus is the bloom strain currently here. If you see the other ones here, we have Chaos currently zero. And then that is currently one. Do you know how long it will take to travel this far? It's interesting to see that they seem to they seem to time out, rather it's not like um, XCOM 1 where three missions and that's it. It seems to have a timing out issue, which means if you're fast enough, I guess we could do most of them, but... Yeah, hey, assuming we can go for fast enough, if I go here, we can go beep, beep here fairly quickly, because if I go there, it'll be far enough for everything else. We're going to go here, we're going to go to this one here, and see if we're fast enough to do this mission and this mission before they time out, although I have no idea how long it'll take. It's 11 days before they time out, so how long will it take to get to this place? Let's find out. Augmentation chamber is operational. Okay, so what does it actually do for us in the long run? One, uh, one. We're gaining. We're gaining augmentation aug, uh, servitors per X days. Okay, we'll start working on the augorium to get our, our prognostic cards online. So we're gaining we're gaining one servitor every twenty days. Okay. Okay, dokey. And I mean, it's not slow, but it's not. It's not fast, but it's not slow either. We might be able to do these two missions. I don't think we would hit that one. That planet's heft. But we arrive. The Baleful Edict is here. We get a Grimoire for this, in fact, which helps us increase our, our research speed. Very happy with that, in fact. Um, okay. Uh, start mission. I guess. I mean, we still have 35 days before Sky is back online, so we'll not take Sky with us. We'll select Knight. Or, uh, swap Knight. So we already have a Justicar already. But we'll take a second Justicar. We'll take Morthen in. Morthen? You can take a Demon Hammer as well. You're, you're, you're in power armor anyway, so... Again, um, because of the... It's just an interesting situation, right? Um, most other chapters, as far as I'm aware, their Terminators have their Storm Bolter in their right hand and their left hand is a melee weapon. Usually a Power Fist or a Chain Fist. Grey Knights don't use Chain Fists or Power Fists, but they have their melee weapon in their right hand and they have the Storm Bolter mounted to the left hand. Which is interesting. Anyway, um... Go there, let's go for the... There you go. 
And there, 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 war gear. You're happy with that. Melee weapon, ranged weapon. You, all you can use is storm bolters. You can't use a storm shield. Uh, not yet, anyway. Right, teleportarium. Um, we'll swap in. I'm gonna swap in. Uh, because everyone else is level one. You're level level two already, Hell's Master. That's we'll bring in Sky. Well, who? <laughs> Looks Sky Rugen, whom I've given a silencer to. So we're being very, very ranged here, and then super melee over here. Start mission. Let's just jump in there. What do you have here? Seven willpower, five willpower, three willpower, uh, five willpower. And that's HP? Is that HP? That is HP, okay. And of course, uh, because you've got Terminator armor, you've already got you got two points of physical armor anyway. You're immune to knockback as well. Uh, what are, what are, what are your powers? Scatter shots. Cult Bane. This guy has a 10% crit chance for all organic enemies. So Rook Sky is very much against organic enemies. You got fast recovery. Okay. Let's get down there and uh, kill the cultists. Slash the pork walkers. Oh, there's a ring around this place. This is the hive world. Probably wasn't paying attention. The higher the bloom corruption, the more the warp surge meter rises every turn. Fact. Nod, nod, nod. Why have you led us here, Inquisitor? There is no sign of strife on the comms. Look more carefully, Knight. The codes used are old, but they are a mark of an active plague cult. Of that, I have no doubt. If that is true, my brothers will make short work of them. Right, we have arrived. Okay. Um, so kill all enemies, no shenanigans. So how big is the map? How big are we talking about? That map stretches far that way. Okay, 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 okay. Um, Praise the Emperor. Morthen. Okay, head to the... Look, Sky? Yes, sir. Let the hunt continue. Right. Pod over there. So we'll prepare to breach the pod. Yes! I like that these machines are properly, like, <laughs> athletic. Because they should be. They're bloody marines. They're bloody space marines. They should be bloody athletic. Yes, sir. The bloom rises 20%, 20%. Yeah. Right. Elva. Can you get in there? No. It will be done. Have a look around in there. We'll head over there. One more. Right. McSky. At once. Let's get eyes around that corner. Gods preserve us. Here's a good spot. Huh, you automatically Brothers, know where everyone is. Ready. I don't I'm not a fan of that, I'll be honest with you. I'm not a fan that you know automatically where they are. Um Can you shoot that? Opening fire! Sil a silencer. Ah! Yes, sir. I like that things move. That's something I do actually enjoy. I like that thing move. Oh. Uh, move to there. I forget that your AP gets reloaded when combat starts. 
I forgot about that. Um, you can't actually overwatch. Interesting, you don't actually overwatch with a silencer. Did not know that. Okay. For Titan. You've, you've got a tentacle arm. Hang on. Auto gun is increased range because of your tentacle arm. Or you have a mutation. Not sure how a tentacle arm does that to your increased range, but hey. The mutation you have is doing something. Um I am with you. I can use psychic console to get the AOE, but do I need to do that really? This one will fall! On the way! Pop you several times. Are you stunned? You will be. Derek is like, ha 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 ha, run away. No, don't give up now. Right. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's just, uh, hang on, can we get... Explode for five damage uh, next turn. Heavy stubber? Attacking or attacking? Strong we should stop. <laughs> Did three damage, I guess. Second pot over there, bloom rises. Okay. Well, might as well. Another falls to the Knights of Titan. Moving swiftly. Fall the Emperor. Terminators pops them. Um, you could heal yourself here, couldn't you? At your service. Moving now. McKay. And you're literally looking in his face, so, uh... What does that do? Inflicts Disrupted. Not sure what Disrupted is, but you can hit him. I am his will! And again? No, no chance. Um... Standing ready. Can you melee? You can punch, I think. You can... It's a, it's a tackle, if you don't worry about tackling, then move over there. Move over... You know what? Let's move over here. With haste! Better could just not DC him for the kill. Feel the bite of my sword! There you go. Another battle ends in triumph! Now what's that number I saw there? So now, um So where is this? It's over there. It's still gonna explode. I, I like the fact that it's still gonna explode. Um, move over there. Here, on the way. I am here to serve. Got a chest. Oh, no, hang on. Um, no. Move over there. And you move over here. At once! It's gonna explode. I assume. Oh, you're still done. Uh, just Overwatch, why not? Boom! Oh, there you go. Sneeze time. As you picking up a lot, you pick up and lob a grenade. Okay. Right. Okay. Um, My blade is yours. As often. Rush up over there. 
Oh, he found Knights him. of the Throne! Uh, get yourself into cover. Yes, sir. They cross over the bridge. Shoot that, no, you cannot. Lob a nade down there. Lob it. Feel my wrath. <laughs> lot, of, lot of death there. A lot of death there from Orthon. Killed three things entirely. Beautiful. Um, With me, my brothers. Feel my wrath. With haste! Fall! And... Over. That's explosive. Don't stand over there. That's a bad idea. Um... Moving now! Get behind cover as well. Do you have any line of sight on anyone? No. No, you do not. Need armor for a Okay. Some kind of grenadier. Destroys the cover. The Aegis is impervious. You will bleed! <laughs> and you're overwatching over there. The bloom is now at 90%. Okay. Yes, Commander. Yes, sir. Actually, you, can just, you can walk over there. You can walk over there and them, but you cannot. Um, there's a side bolt right there. <laughs> just pop them. And... Plump, plump, plump. Right. McSky. Uh, Standing you. ready. Because you've got the first, you've got the um I can shoot you. They're not close enough, in which case. Last AP. Did some damage at least. Yes, sir. Move you over there. Disrupt shot. It's gonna go up no matter what, isn't it? Might as well find out what happens. Aye, sir! Disrupted, whatever that is. Destroy the bridge? Destroys the bridge! Oh, Interesting. I'm interested to see what that actually does. What, what, what would that have done if I had I been on the bridge? You had to reload, didn't you? Yeah, you did. Overwatching or just shooting? Yeah. Just shooting. You're hungered. Commander, I sense a massive spike in warp activity below. It is a warp surge, Inquisitor. Such events are common in pitch battles between psychers. And yet your brothers have clearly restrained their powers. Something foul is at work below. Okay, that's reinforcements. Right, okay. Yeah. Sewer manhole cover. 
Go there, pick it up and chuck it. Go on. That's what was happening before. <laughs> God, that makes me funny. Um, I just find that funny. Um, Unleash me! Vengeance! Imperium! Okay. Let's move over there. You shoot? You're out of ammo. Fine. Advancing. Partial full cover at medium range does this is gonna do one damage to you. Oh. Everyone's pinning it with right now. Time bomb! I sense the enemy converging. Multiple box walkers. Prepare to engage! Bloom rises yet again. Right up. Um. Here! Uh, you can't do much. I am with you! I need more of them to deal with the guy back here. I am here to serve. Or try going kills, so I don't bother. Again. I'm kind of wondering. Uh, hmm. What is your will? All right, if you move, what do you have here? We have. What are you? You are a grenadier with a time bomb and a toxic grenade. Does zero damage, but a fixed pinned. Um. Then you are the pox walker with a resistance bonus. The rest of you are just regular pops. Okay, fine. We need to die, basically. We know this. We know that this much. It will be they, done. they need to die. Can we do a scatter shot here? We're gonna give it a shot. Opening fire. Beautifully done. <laughs> I must sanctify my rounds. <laughs> Beautifully executed that was. Reload this. I am very proud of you. And you get to basically blast this guy to smithereens. I sir. And what does that mean for you? I don't understand what that means for you. What did that what did that symbol mean? I don't know. Still gonna shoot again though. It's like a console to finish you off. All enemies have been cleansed. Good work, Commander. Okay, we're learning learning more how to deal with what's happening. Willpower? I don't know if it's just willpower, but name anyway, we have returned. We can just, really? You can't even skip this animation? Okay. Great. How many people are wounded and for how long? We have a grim we've got a grimoire, nice. Nobody's no, there you go. Okay, barrack levels up. And you've got light wounds for three for thirty for a month. Let's promote you, Barrack. So you are an apothecary. You gain plus one ammo to your equipped weapon. What if that's an, if that's natural to you? You get what? You have this knight's cyborg inflicts bleed. Okay, and you also have increased that. You can also get terminate. <laughs> of course, they can all use terminator armor, can't they? That's the whole point. Warp speed, biomancy. Hmm. Okay. And they have scourging. All bleed afflictions last for three, an additional three turns. 
Emperor's Judgment affects Hobbled. Core Discipline increases your max increases your max move spell power again. Battlefield Medicine gives plus two to heal. Plus two to heal. This is four strikes to lead. This knight's melee attacks collect all bloom seeds from the target. That looked like it. That looks like it might be relevant. Knight's servo skulls gain ammo as well. Hmm. A little biomancy over here. Biomancy's over here. Hmm. Interesting. 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 Right, um... A mock required. Oh, okay. It goes side on, rather than down. Okay, that makes more sense, I guess. Increases the area of scourging. Alternatively, you get biomancy. Iron Arm Biomancy, Surgical Adept, Stun Upgrade Duration, Endurance Biomancy, Sympathetic Biomancy. Ooh. Okay, so get Biomancers into. The you can be Biomancers. Ooh, so, so everything is so tempting. Everything is so tempting. Um, you also have minus three to your heal for a turn. I don't know. I have not yet decided. I have not yet decided. So, okay, so, uh... uh technically, it's gonna take us six days to... Mission unreachable in time. Damn it. Okay. That's unfortunate. Mission is unreachable in time. In that case, I want to move back to the middle. So you just, just attempt to make it in time. I guess what we're doing. I guess this is what we're doing. Let's see what happens then. When this runs out, does that means that gets added to plus one? We cannot afford to sit on our hands while the bloom spreads unchallenged. Yeah, they expired. Manda. Edict will not be able to reach all missions before they expire. Reconstruction of the warp drive and Ogorium systems will make it easy to reach missions with time to spare. That's why we're preparing the Ogorium right now. The Ogorium is now operational. The Prognostic Choir is functional once again. Now, we can do Barracks upgrade, we can do Ogorium upgrade. As prognostic cars to the list. Um, the plasma reactor we haven't got the services for. We can do the Orgorium for 18 days. Help with that. We have restored functionality to the Orgorium and should review our Augurium. prognostica choir. When prognosticas are attuned to a system, they will extend the mission timer in all adjacent systems. Okay. Select a system. So, we want to maximize. That pretty much maximizes that entire quadrant there. That maximizes this group here. That maximizes. Ah, oh, damn it. I'll probably, I'll probably put one here. That it's all that. One here. I'm assuming that the map will expand. But this seems to be the best place to start off with because it hits the most areas at once. Your prognostic car is now prognosticating over there. You've arrived. 
Do a prognostication over here. Okay, good. Which means here we just have the... Okay. I guess we move central again? Go back to the middle, make sure we are roughly in the right place. We have two days left until the Poxwalker Necropsy, which is our guess our next thing to pay attention to. There you go. This Poxwalker was one of the Imperial Faithful, afflicted with a strain of mutagenic virus. He was given there a gift. There is no human. doubt we are dealing with the work of the plague god Nurgle. This must be the bloom whispered of in those astropathic fragments. Within the carcass, I found a germ of some ancient power corrupted with a foul psychic resonance. This seed is used to spread the virus. Of that, I am certain. But it arrived to me damaged, and there is little else I can learn from it. In order to study how we might fight this plague, I must acquire one of these seeds completely intact. I can instruct your brothers on how to extract these specimens properly. Please ensure they pay attention. The Emperor loathes indolence. Let's not disappoint him. Like <laughs> Grandmaster's report. This is Inquisitor Cartha Vakir of the Ordo Malleus. I am alumnus of Evixia Danica. Access code. Clarion, Magenta, 11, 17, 21. I require immediate response from Titan. This is Grandmaster Vardan Kai responding, Inquisitor. This act borders on heresy. The screams of the astropods you burned already reverberate through the warp. It is fortunate for you that I am prosecuting a campaign in the nearby Chimera system. I suggest you explain yourself and quickly. Grandmaster, I have commandeered the Baleful Edict. We face... You have seized a Grey Knight Strike Cruiser. As is my right. I have foreseen dire omens for this sector. Already Nurgle's poxwalkers roam free. Oh, indeed. I'm surprised an agent of your pedigree is not equipped to deal with such lesser threats of chaos. Agravain, perhaps you can clear up this nonsense for me. My lord, he fell in battle during our last campaign against the Cadium cult. We had been returning to Titan for repairs when this Inquisitor intervened. Ah, oh, Brother Ektar, that is sorry news. I trust then that you have appointed one of our brothers to act in his stead. Well, speak up then, Commander. What say you to this Inquisitor's story? Why did your voice just change at the last line there? Uh... We shall discuss the bloom seed. Intriguing. However, the galaxy is. There's no one. She says the Inquisitor has discovered a corrupted artifact in the Apocalypse. I am Pops. confident these are the symptoms of a symptom of a much greater cancer. I only need a little time to conduct further research. Very well. I am not in the habit of second guessing those under my command. That is, until given a good reason. I will leave the baleful edict in your care. You have my thanks, Grandmaster, but there is yet another reason I desire to speak with you. As steward of the Armory of Titan, I had hoped you could release further assistance. Don't thank me yet. I will give you 60 Tertian solar days to prove this threat warrants the deployment of an entire strike force. Battleworn as it is, Strike Force Cyphos could be put to good use in several campaigns across the galaxy. Any further requisition from my arsenal will have to be earned. But I... Typical. Oh well. After each Grand Master's report, you can spend your requisition to unlock and upgrade armor slots. The resource slot gives you access to the new knight reinforcements, servitors, grimoires, and other resources at the end of a mission. You can only unlock or upgrade each slot once per report. Slot upgrades increase your chance of accessing more and better equipment and resources. Don't quite follow this. So reward chance one goes from never to always, two to never, three to never. So this gives us so rain so night requisition increases your chance of recruiting grenades at higher starting ranks. Additional knights will be made available through mission rewards on a rotation basis. Titan does not guarantee a knight and any specific class will be available. Then you have increased 
storm mortal patterns, relic cyclones, silences and incinerators. From halberds of forcers to anesthesiums and warding staves, your melee requisition will increase your chance of being drafted higher grade mastercrafted weapons, mastercrafted armor, mastercrafted. Okay, we'll go. For, we'll go with. Oh, we have. Oh, okay. We can. We've got multiple. Okay, so we'll go with. We'll start with weapons. How about that? Weapons. We'll pick our knights and weapons. Confirm. We'll go. We'll go with that. Are you satisfied with the current requisition request, Commander? There won't be another chance until the Grand Master contacts you again. Yeah, sure, why not? Within the carcass, I found a psychically infused seed, a germ of some ancient power now corrupted with foul spiritual resonance. Seed is attacked. To the start of this bloom, but it was damaged in the Proxwalker's destruction. The next step was be to extract one of these psychic seeds whole from a functioning host. Anyway, folks, I'll catch you all next time. See you then. Bye bye. <laughs>